Hi, this is Carlos Cousins, and the following ACT data interpretation question um, is asking basically what we can conclude from um, a result based off of the table provided. Um, all you have to do is look for um, sort of instances where the same words that are used or the same types of results occur in the table and then try to match up with the answers. So in table one, so uh, that I have up here for you, I want the kerosene drop to move less than five millimeters. Uh, okay, well, we see the words kerosene drop show up here twice. So we're going to be looking at this part of the table for sure. Uh, and for it to have moved less than five millimeters, looks like all of these measurements are in millimeters. We are only going to be looking at values that are less than five. So we're going to be looking at this one here for E. coli, this one for the lactobacillus SS SPP, and this one for the lactobacillus SPP of a different number of cells per milliliter. Um, okay, so now it's just asking, uh, though, in the first 30 minutes of a trial. Well, here we're looking for when it moved in the first half hour, or 0.5 hours, which is equivalent to 30 minutes, Whereas here we're looking at how much it moved after two hours. So we're not even going to look at this one at all. We're only going to have to concentrate on this column here. So, um, you know, that a sample for which this happened contained which bacterial cells? Well, the only ones in the running now are going to be E. coli and the lactobacillus. Let's go ahead and look at our answer choices. Um, Dilococcus and Lactobacillus SPP 1x107. Well, the Dilococcus was greater than five after um, was greater than five millimeters after 30 minutes. So we can get rid of that. E. coli and Rhodospirillum, no. Uh, e. coli, yep. The Rhodospirillum was greater than five. Dilococcus again, no. E. coli, okay, yep. So that was less than five. And Lactobacillus 106, yep. That was zero, also less than five. So this here has to be the right answer choice. I hope that helped with this question and happy prepping.